Hey there, people. My name is Tagore, and welcome back to more Chris Tales. We need to get the mouse off the screen. We need to enter the city. <laughs> and uh, see what's here. We're looking for uh, another one of the... Uh, oh, what is it? Mother or something. Mother Superior. There, there it is. Welcome to Floodside District. Are you alright, Christopher? Now look who's acting strange. Leave me alone. I've just been missing my mother's food, that's all. We are not here to sample the cuisine. We should go to the cathedral to see if we can get Chris Bell's powers back. Christopher, you're a local, right? <sighs> Show us the way to the cathedral. Lead the way. We'll follow the sound of your stomach rumbling. In a bit. I need to take care of something first. He sounds so serious. So I'm sorry. I'll catch up with you later. Interesting. Well, let's see what we can find in town here. This is so much fun! Mario! Isn't that dangerous? Mm, yeah, but it's the only fun thing in town. Now, I did notice him down there. Oh. Yeah, that looks pretty dangerous. Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> He's being washed away. He is dead. Hey, wait a second. Somebody... Oh, no. I suppose that somebody is going to be us. But I don't have my time powers. I don't think I can help. Oh, you fool. Powers or not, you can still guide the future. Everything we do today determines what is to come. Uh, I think that's pretty good advice. Maestro, you're right. Let's go. Uh, another save point there. So, let's just check out what's going on around here. Nothing over here. Okay, good to know. I wonder if that wave comes like, at regular intervals or something. Oh, I so want to look for a shop. Hmm? Mister, we just saw a child get swept away by those currents. Oh dear. And? And? That's all you can say? And? Not my problem. I don't get paid to deal with stuff like that. So, no thank you. Ah! You're not going to help us? <laughs> no. Go look for someone that gives a damn. Fun. Oh, she looks like she could use some help. Damn, these crates are heavy. <sighs> At least I don't have to go up Mount Thysia anymore. Likely just become another statistic. What does she mean? Oh, Christopher. Uh, this looks like a shield shop. You've been doing what? Why aren't you with mom? Excuse me? I've been spending all my time trying to make Floodside livable, and you think you can just... Christopher! What? Not now, guys. I'm in the middle of something. It's no use. He's not listening to us. We'll have to do this without his help. So, I guess that's his dad? Um, I don't think we can get behind this building unless we go through. That could be a possibility. What are you? You look tired. Need s somewhere to crash? Just 50 marbles g gets you each a bed where you can sleep easy. No, thank you. If you change, change your mind. We're always here. That's really interesting. A lot of character in just that little, uh, little, uh, exchange. Maybe if I sewed it with that old... Oh, who am I kidding? No amount of work can turn these rags into a real gown. Oh? So it does seem like people here are living in Flood squalor. Floodside is rough, but having family and friends makes it worthwhile. 
Flood side is oh. right. They say the same thing. Don't tell me my son is still out there playing in the flood water. Should we tell her? There's no need to cause her undue worry. Let's just save that child. Quickly. Okay. Some sort of ball court here, maybe? Yeah, you can go around. No. All right. Well, I think I've explored all that I can. I do want to experience as much of this game as possible. So part of that means talking with as many people as I can. Don't worry. We'll save you. Oh. That's not good. is first, but I think I want to pass. Because I want... Oh, wait. I don't think I can... Whatever. Um... Yeah, I can... Oh, he's immune to poison. I don't... Yeah, I've lost the ability to use my crystal. Okay. Not bad. Nice! Zero damage. damage, or rather, a perfect hit. I missed that one. What is this even called? Poisonous Slime! I should have realized just from the name that it was immune to poison. Nice. Another zero. Cool. Oh. It got a little sad. Oh, I was about to say that it's uh, getting close to dying. I didn't think it was that close though. yourself right now, Crispell. But, Maestro, if I had my power... Even with your powers, you can't expect to make everyone happy. What's important is that we choose to do the right thing for those that need our help. Ah, oh, more good advice. I guess you're right. You did the right thing, Crispell. You changed the future for the better. That is true. Uh, Mr. Miss! Oh, right. Sorry. Let's get you back to your mom. Is it going to shoot us outside? It's just going to drop us outside, isn't it? Mario! Yep. Are you okay? Thank you for saving him. We're glad to be able to help. Mom, I don't feel so good. Amigo. Let's get some soup in you before you catch your death. You'll be better in no time. Oh, okay. And I wonder if that means Christopher is done over here.
Why are you with me? No. What are you guys? Well, we were hoping for some oh. help. Although I guess we've managed to get by so far. Wait, wasn't this place flooded before? What's going on? A boy, Mario, got swept away by the waters. We had to fight a monster to save him. I... I'm sorry. You needed me and I wasn't there to help. I let you down. Christopher? What happened? Who are these people? Nothing, Dad. These are my friends. Chris Bell and Wilhelm. They're from Nairima. Oh, it's a pleasure, kids. The name's Armando. Are you refugees from Narim? I've heard... No, sir. We're only travelers looking for the cathedral here in the city. Oh, sorry. I just got so wrapped up in this. The cathedral is inside the walled city. The area of town up those steps to the north. But they don't let just anyone up there. You need a special crest to enter the city. Lucky for us, I happen to have one. Nice. Why? Oh. Water. Let's go. Are you going to speak to your mother? This isn't about mom or you. Chris Bell has important business here. I'm going to help her. Of course. Well, if you do see your mother, tell her. Oh, never mind. Okay, the elemental mage. And Mateus is right behind us, right on our heels. I am excited to find. Yes. Need anything? An yes, an we're going to the equipment shop, city. accessory shop, I'm something like that. Sophia's son. That crest, you. I mean, please go ahead, sir. Interesting. Uh, do I go in here? No. Okay. So left or right? Probably take us to the same place. I highly doubt that there's anything on the other side, so I will still go down the right, if I can, <laughs> on my way out. Unless it just kicks me out of the city, in which case, we'll probably be back. Ooh. Ooh. I love it. <gasps> Weapons! That's what I want to look at. Welcome to Walled City. The city is beautiful. It must have been wonderful to grow up here, Christopher. It was. My brother and I got up to all kinds of trouble. Someone should inform these people that there's a war going on. They know. St. Clarity has sent plenty of soldiers to fight. Including my brother. Oh, God. He died protecting Crystallis, you know. Oh. Yes, I know. There were a great many sacrifices that day. Thanks to those brave souls, the city still stands. For now. Shall we focus for a moment? We should find the cathedral before some new dire fate befalls us. Was that foreshadowing? The city still stands for now. Whatever, we'll see. Um, and this is all a little weird. <laughs> Um, hey, wait a second. Is that Christopher? So real quick, my brother's name is Chris. Christopher. Um, so this sounds a little weird <laughs> to me. Uh, yeah, you. You seem to know Christopher. Hi. Audrey, are you taking apart grandfather clocks? Everyone, this is Audrey, an incredible inventor and a good friend. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Audrey. I'm Chris Bell. Chris and Chris, huh? Well, I don't actually work on clocks, although it's a perfectly respectable profession. I build mechanical creatures that are powered by the rubies. A lot of them are based on things I learned by studying the nearby ruins. A magical automaton? It sounds like something out of an ancient legend. The energy in rubies is certainly plentiful enough. I suppose it was only a matter of time until someone figured out how to advance the science. Well, I was advancing until Enzo slashed my budget. Don't tell me that prick has worked his way into the ruby business. Whoa! Oh well. I don't even want to tell you the rest. He's up at the courthouse doing all kinds of business. 
He sounds unpleasant, but he is an important person here. Perhaps we should speak with him anyways. Before that, don't forget, we still need to find the cathedral. Oh, that's right. It's a straight line to the west. You can't miss it. Thanks for the help, Miss Audrey. We're off then. So I will look at the cathedral. People in Floodside think they're the only ones who have it bad. I've got a leak in my roof. Imagine. Oh, yes, that's dreadful. Hmm. The rich being better than everyone. Well, I can't let just anyone in, you see. Okay, I'm fine with that. Okay, good day. <laughs> Have fun. I do like that... Wait a second, what's through here? I do like that Mateus has to... Uh, run to keep up with us. He struggles. I'll talk with you in just a second, buddy. Who I want to talk to is you. You're not from St. Clarity, right? Meow? Huh? Excuse me? No need to. Welcome to my store. Have a free souvenir as part of my new client program. Meow? But we haven't bought anything yet. No need to thank me. It's a special present just for you. Meow? <gasps> Wood ring! Yay! How to? You have received your first piece of equipment! You can put it to use by opening the menu and accessing the equipment screen. Okay. There are many different kinds of equipment for you to try on. Some can only be used by certain party members. Experiment and find which equipment suits you the best. Ahem. So, you're in the Wildcat Armory! Looking for anything in particular? No? Time synthesis? What is this? <gasps> Wait. Oh, okay, it's up and down. Uh, what is this? Superior Botanist Scythe. That's a scythe? I suppose. Um. Okay. Keychain effects. Hmm. So this does cost quite a bit. And uh, I don't think that I'll use that just yet. So let's see what else she has in her store. Ooh. Wow, right, Grace. So I'm assuming. Yeah, it does tell us on the right who can equip what. So what does this do? Defense plus two. Not bad. Um. So what do we got? type of equipment is this stuff? Oh! Okay. So, from what I can see so far, uh, Chris Bell is the offensive one, Christopher is defensive, and uh, Wilhelm is the mage. Potions, bracelets, left ring, right Oh. Whoa. Oh. Oh, that's what that is. That's a symbol of Nareem. Okay. And it certainly synergizes well with those two. Anyway. This is probably better for uh, Christopher. Wait, Chris Bell starts the game with this? Interesting. I did not notice that. Keychains. Ten thousand for a tent? E. Okay, so what... Am I going to want to buy anything? Reduces speed. This is a small boost to defense. It's also expensive. I mean, look at that. 15,000, 10,000. Ugh. 
Well, anyway, um... Maybe it is just better to synthesize. Ugh. Uh, equipment. So, she should have this. Why didn't it just have it equipped regardless? Um, what is it? Here we go, wood ring. This should, yep, up his defense. So... Oh. I got that wrong! Christopher is the, the mage, and he, uh, Wilhelm is the defensive one. Oh, yeah. Okay. You're in the wild. So, with that in mind... Um, I actually do want to buy Magical Attack. Yeah, that's good. Uh, oh. Yeah, whatever. Um, okay. Well, unfortunately, we really can't buy too much. I'm supposed to go down there yet. I just found out I can do magic. Good for you. Cool, huh? You wouldn't even believe the things I'm learning at the university over in Tulira. Go on, test my knowledge. What's a good way to deal with slimes? Uh, it depends on the type of slime and its color, but the ones near Mount Thesea are weak against lightning. I've heard that there are slimes that became contaminated and turned poisonous. Those are really weak against water. Wow, that would have been useful to I've have Chris. Christopher. God, this is going to be confusing, isn't it? Alright, so this should be the cathedral. It's definitely different. That floor is reflective. Oh, T.S., there's something wrong. I don't feel anything special here. Agreed. If anything, this place feels somewhat dangerous. That is indeed strange. And who is that fellow? Was there not supposed to be a mother superior here? Right. But I don't see her. Was there perhaps a different cathedral here once? This is the same cathedral I grew up with. Except they changed the stained glass. Why change yourselves when you can just change the faith that condemns you? What? Never mind. Perhaps the fact that the mural is missing has something to do with Crispell not feeling a connection. So what are we going to do now? We need to figure out what happened here. Someone must know something. Let's try speaking with the priest. Okay. Nothing over there. I am Father Miguel, the lady's humble disciple. I see that you are not members of my congregation. How can I help you? How do you know that from a glance? I know this might seem like a strange question, but have there been any renovations to this cathedral in recent years? We do have small renovations from time to time, but nothing major has changed in years. Oh, well, that, uh, renov- he said renovations. I see. Um, why do those murals show a crowning? I recognize the lady, but who is the other person? The man receiving the crown. I wonder how much he looks like the guy who paid for this installation. I know all about the regular doctor. But here in St. Clarity, we believe that the people who take care of us are the ladies' hands in this world. Is that why you changed out the stained glass? Oh, that was years ago. 
I doubt many people even remember the old one. Do you happen to know what happened to the old glass mural they removed? I wouldn't know. But perhaps General Enzo, the leader of the city, might remember. He was the one who ordered it. If my mind doesn't fail me, he should be in the courthouse of the city. As always, he's looking for the progress of our dear St. Clarity. All right. Thank you for your help, Father. Of course, my child. May the lady watch over you in your search. Okay, interesting. That's definitely information. General Enzo? And I'm assuming we're not going to be just let in. Um, we haven't talked to this guy. Back off! I'm just trying to make a living here! Is the general against that, too? I, I guess... Aren't you from Floodside? How did you even get up here? Oh, so this guy just snuck in! Oh, look, here's a save point. I'm gonna... Shall we make a record of our adventure? I yeah. want to record... Damn it. There we go. So now can I go this way? The docks are over there. Oh. I do not think Enzo would be... I just want to look at the statue. Oh, wait, where'd the friend go? Huh. In. Can I go in here? Ooh. Greetings, me. It's oh. only two hundred. No, thank you. Just let. Okay. It seems that ends. Dang it. Do I need to heal? That's what I wanted to check. It does not look like it. Okay. Um. Can I help you? No, you can't. Well, I can't let just any. You must be new. I'm Christopher. I'm guessing my mother left instructions to let me pass if I ever showed up again. Ah, indeed she did. She's talking with the general just now, but I'm sure she will be free soon. I will tell her that you are here. Who is his mother? I mean, I guess we're going to see that in just a second, but... And so, we aim to move from a four times increase in output this season to as much as five or six times a normal yield before the winter. But if I were you, I would place an order now. Supplies of rubies might be going up, but not as fast as the demand for them is. What the people demand is justice! Oh no, Dad, not again. What is going on? My dad, he does this sort of thing, stirring up trouble, constantly campaigning against inequality in the city. You sit up here living in luxury, while wrong, those though? who mind the rubies live in squalor! How did he get here? Someone, escort this instigator out, please. Yeah! And not only that, you've been monopolizing our resources! Ugh, now the inventor girl is here too? This has gone too far, Armando. You've crossed the line. Guards, take these rabble-rousers out. Hmm... Oh, you do not look good. Wait, you good. seem familiar. Do less talking and more listening, Risa. This is how a leader leads. Look how he's convinced the whole room to buy from him. Interesting. Who might you be? Sophia's son, if you really need to know. Hmm, I suppose I can see the resemblance. You don't really take after the general, though. Of course I don't look like the general. Why would I... Oh, no. Not him. Mom. I hate to be kept waiting like this, but the demand for red crystals is so high these days. Hmm? Where do you come in from? We just arrived from Nareen. Ah, well, you might be out of luck then. You can't get a meeting with him unless he thinks you come from a rich province. We're just... <sighs> get your hands off me! You heard General Enzo. You have to leave immediately. Hey! Take your hands off of Armando! I don't think much is going to be resolved. Where do you think you're going, huh? No one is allowed near General Enzo. Christopher, you're home. 
I was afraid you'd oh. never come back. Guards, stand down. Oh, uh, terribly sorry, ma'am. Please go ahead, Mr. Christopher, sir. What finally brings you back home, dear? It wasn't really a planned thing. Won't you introduce us to your friends? It's complicated. They're, um, time mages. Excuse me, miss, but you have a beautiful home. It reminds me of my own village. Only grander. Thank you. We've been very fortunate. Now that we've modernized the production of rubies, all of St. Clarity has been thriving. Well, mm. Floodside doesn't really seem like it's thriving. Yep, my sentiments exactly. It will just take time. Eventually, the prosperity will reach everyone. I would think so-called time mages would be able to see that future for themselves. What are you doing with this guy? All the people you could pick. You might be Sophia's son, but I'll thank you to treat me with respect. Yeah, okay. Look, we just want to know what happened to the stained glass mural that got removed from the cathedral. The priest said you were the one who ordered it. Just tell us where it is, and I promise you can go crawl back under your dung heap. Hmm. I see you inherited your father's low class irreverence. Unlike him, most hardworking citizens look up to me. And they pretty much have to, since you live up here on a walled in hill. Christopher, please, enough of this. I know the mural you're talking about. It was dumped in the waters by the docks years ago, along with other trash from the cathedral. What? Come on, Chris Bell. Let's go find it. We're done here. Mm. I mean, yeah. I mean, you would think people would save something like that. It's still art, even if it's unwanted in its original location. Someone would probably want it. So, the docks are where we came from, I'm assuming. No, it is this way. <gasps> Yay! I just get so happy whenever I see that world map. Oh, it's so cute. Oh. Chris Bell, what do you want to do? I want to record our. Why is there that already? It's an ancient titan, one of the witnesses. Scholars say they're meant to remind us that the lady is always watching. And looks like one of my grumpy aunts. Look, something's happening to it. Who is this lady? I'm assuming she's gonna be, what? Pretty important later on, ish. Oh my God, she's coming to talk to us. <laughs> oh, she's sad. Did you all just see that? The giant statue moved. I feel something inside that staff. It appears we have been invited to enter. What do you think could be inside? Only one way to find out. The water, uh, as simple as it is, seems very, very clear. I love it. Mural. You feel something now? Oh, who is it this time? It's been ages since I've had a visitor. And the last ones were a little more than thieves. Who? Ah, hello, darling. You must be a... Oh, how interesting. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You didn't answer my question. Oh, sorry. I was admiring... Well, never mind. Well, hello. I am Paulina, witness of the ages. Ah, oh, it feels good to be able to move again. My first love is fashion, but I'm always interested in talking to a time mage. Especially one who recently lost her powers. Would you care to explain how you knew that? <laughs> I see your shorts match your fuse. Just because I look this good doesn't mean I can't also be good at what I do. I don't suppose you could help us figure out what to do about Crispel's powers, could you? Oh, yes, yes. Well, I won't be doing much of anything. 
It will be on you to remedy that situation. Just step over to the altar. Okay. I feel something, but I don't know if... Oh. You! What are you doing here? Just when Crispell doesn't have her pat... Uh, ouch! Christopher! How could you be so careless? Ah, uh, did you hear this, Claude? I think he really believes he'll beat us twice. Too bad we can only kill him once. Maybe her grace will let us rewind him a few times. For sport. Everyone listen! We need to focus on inflicting as much indirect damage as we can. Oh, that's very cute! Strategize all you want, we'll still pound you to smithereens. <laughs> this will be interesting. I do hope you all at least put on a good show. Okay. Oh boy. Damn. <laughs> Starting out great there. Um, skills. No reason to attack behind skill water. Well, we dealt damage. All she has is heal. Or at least dealing damage. Um, so I'm gonna poison them. Yes. Oh, how quaint! They've been training for this rematch. You do know we can be ruthless without being overconfident, don't you? One damage. Nice. So, I don't know what Soaked does. You still only know Water Bubble. Applies wet. 78. Uh, still only heal. Defense up. Nice. Um. What do we have? really anything useful, so I'll just attack. Crispell! You need to reach out to the power of the- But how? Whatever it is you felt before, you need to find that again. Hurry! Oh, here we go. Powers back, I'm assuming. <gasps> Power. Synchro. What is this? This doesn't feel the same as before. Oh, darling. Do I have to do everything around here? What? That kid with the big mouth. I'm sure you can feel something inside you. Is she talking about me? Focus inside. And while you do that, think of the girl with the tragic fashion sense. Wait. You do the same, girl, except you think of the kid with the regrettably tacky goggles. What? Hold on. I think Chris Bell's cute. I'm trying. While you two try to connect, let me explain how this works. As you fight, you'll gather energy. Synchro points, if you will. When you have enough energy, you'll be able to activate a powerful synchronization skill. You can trigger it by just pressing the button. Okay. Um, let me just synchro summon then. Watery brand. Strike a single enemy twice, dealing water damage. Okay. All right. Use the crystals. Wait, what? Do I have the crystals? <gasps> Future crystal. Damn it! Not this again! This is so unfair! Ugh. Quickly, back to 
to the Empress. These things are sort of the uh, tutorial enemies, aren't they? I guess it would make sense. Impressive. Synchros are powerful abilities that can turn the tide of battle around. Always keep an eye on it and your friends, since you'll also be able to use this power on their turns. Don't forget to plan ahead. Remember that you don't lose stored synchro points after you finish a battle. Okay. The crystals! I have their power again! But that connection... What was that? I don't really know how it happened. Now we know that you're the real thing, darling. What do you mean, real Just thing? Proved you have the power to link with those close to you. This seems like an incredible power. But be careful, and take it slowly. I can feel it. I can feel your presence. I can feel it too. Does this mean we're combining our powers? Sinking would be more precise. We are using our powers in a more unified way. This seems to connect all of us, but only through Crispel. A great discovery indeed. It could have happened in a less dangerous way though. Don't be so melodramatic. This is a holy place. You were never in any real danger. So what do we do now? Come on. We should try to rest a little bit. Let's find somewhere back in town. Come back and visit any time. Maybe I can even pick out something that would flatter your figure, darling. Do it. So what is this? I've always wondered if my calling oh. in life was to design beautiful garments. Okay, it's just to talk with her. So, with that, we have the power of the crystals back, and then some. So... Um, okay. I was hoping maybe... Oh. Crispel. Mom? What are you doing out here? I have a favor to ask. Aren't you in a relationship with the most powerful man in the city? Why not ask him? It's not that simple. When Enzo came to power, he did a lot for the economy of the city. He found investors who helped us modernize the production of the rubies. What are these rubies? They're what you get when you fuse together a lot of red crystal dust. The dust exists as a trace mineral in many things, and it has magical properties. It has many uses in magic devices, and can even be used to create armor and weapons. Oh? That's why rubies are so valuable. We've been exporting more of them than ever before. But there are things about the operation that Enzo has been hiding, even from me. One of the teams of workers that went up Mount Thysia never came back. The official story is that they were delayed by a rock slide, but I know it's not true. He had them killed. And now the people in Floodside are starting to notice. I'd like for you to investigate. No I'm home for one day and you're already sending me away again? No. I just... I saw that fight you just had, and... You and your friends are the only ones I know who don't work for Enzo. And you, Crispel, really are a time mage. Please, use your powers to find out what happened to the missing workers. I'll do it. So what does her power Thank actually you. look like? Come and see me privately afterwards. To, like, an outsider? Would it just look like a... Temporal, like an area of, of effect thing. Ah, whatever. In any case, I hope you've been enjoying this. I know I have. And please join me again for another episode of Chris Tales. <laughs>